and welcome to Click Fix. In this video, I will talk about how to install Click Geo Analytics Connector for Click Sense. Make sure you have downloaded the latest version. For this demonstration, I will install September 2018. The first thing you have to do is just open your Click Sense Management Console and go to Extensions and search for any IDVO extensions you might have. In my case, I have all of these. All you need to do is remove them. This will prevent any problems with the new ones. So I select them all and click on the delete button. Now you can start to import your new IDVO connectors. Press the import button, choose the downloaded install zip file, and complete the import one by one. Unfortunately, it's not possible to select all of them at once. As you work down the list, you can see the names. So now I have imported all of the IDVO extension files. As you can see here, the next step is to install the Geo Analytics Setup version September 2018. Right click on it, run as administrator, click yes, accept the agreement. On this part, by default, we're using Click Cloud URL. If you prefer to use your own server, this is a step to set that URL to the server. Normally, it's the machine name. Then we get the License Activation Tool. Go ahead and fill in the fields the owner name, the organization, and here you enter the license and control number. Choose the installation. We'll leave it in custom installation. Selecting the ClickSense server will set some default file locations. Normally that would be a shared location. So navigate to the shared location copy this path, paste it in, and activate the license. Now we can test the connection. And to actually take a look at this, we need to open the hub. You can open the hub by clicking on the monitoring apps. Now with the hub open in a new tab, we can open any app. This one is my example. And open the data load editor and wait until the Create New Connection is available. Click on it, scroll down to the Click Geo Analytics Connector, click to select it, and we can give the connection a name. Test Oscar. Test the connection. And it looks like the connection is working fine. And save. In case the connector isn't showing up in the list, then you might need to reboot the machine. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great rest of your day. Nailed it.